Hello, this is Red Taito bringing you some World of Tanks gameplay. Um, this is part two of how to play World of Tanks, and today we'll be showing you how to battle. Okay, so at, as to start, this is not in the game. This is a mod I'm using. Uh, again, I still can't remember the name of the mod pack. Uh, um, again, with the coloured. I'll get up to that later. But, um,. Here we've got the mini map. This will show you the entire map that you're currently playing on. Um, I am currently playing on El Haluf in this replay um, in my VK three oh six one uh, three uh, VK three six oh one H. Um, so to start on the mini map. Um, it's a basic map graph. Um, if you press hold down control it will bring up your mouse cursor and that will allow you to select parts of the map I can't do it here because I'm in a replay but it will select these areas here and it will alert that those areas to your teammates uh, to the bottom left here is your stat the tank stats in the current game so that's your engine the, it, at the moment, all my all my uh, modules are fine. They are fully working. But if someone was to shoot you in your module and damage it, it would either be damaged or destroyed, and it would have to be repaired. That's why you've got a repair kit. A repair kit can be used to repair the damaged object or destroyed object fully, um, instantly. But that can but that obviously if you use it you can't use it again unless you buy another one um, up here are the scores how many enemy players are alive and how many ally players are alive and up here you've got your obviously your your game your game stats um, down here are the different teams they can be switched around with these I'm not going to reveal anyone's names in this though. Um, here we, yeah, obviously you got all the tanks, but um, with the mod I'm using at the moment, it, these this basically shows how experienced the player is. Um, but this is a mod, but that's not part of the game. And these are the tiers of the tanks and the different you know icons of what tanks they're driving. Um, and you've got your timer here. This is currently the, the waiting session. You have to wait for all the players to to come into the game before it starts. But, yeah, that's... Oh, you've got your ammo down here, which can be selected by pressing these keys. Or double-tapping these keys. So, uh, let's get this replay going. So, as you can see, I'm waiting for the timer to go down. Okay, so with a map like El Haluf, I prefer to go left, um, which will take us down to the valley, and it will be able, it will let us push up to the left of the enemy side. Now, most people don't don't like this map. I I don't mind it. I find it quite boring, but it's, it's quite an easy map to play. Um, you can already see at the, the, the right, people are starting to die. So we've already got, our team's already got one kill. And me and this T20 are just going to push up this mountainside here. In, we're down in the valley at the moment. If you look to the right, you'll see that the enemy team has got a kill. Now, I'm looking over the right here, and I can see some enemies have been spotted, but because of the angle of my tank, I don't realise that my gun will not be able to reach that M5. But then you see here, there's a KV-1S attacking the T20. I want to be quite cautious because the KV-1S has got quite a powerful gun. 
fact, probably the most powerful for its tier. But it's got a very long reload. 15 seconds. So I just want to hang back. Let this KV-1S maybe take a shot. So he puts a shot in him, and I quickly, without aiming, I take him out. That was actually a very well placed shot that wasn't aimed. <laughs> At the moment, we're winning 3 2, 4 2. You see, artillery is pummeling us at the moment so basically we're just pushing into the enemy side of the map right now I spot a hellcat he's being battered but I just don't get the kill Okay, so we come round here, and the enemies are waiting for us. So I put a shot into that Churchill. That you also, his aim time is, uh, his reload time is very short, more much shorter than mine. I finish him off. KV one runs away. And he's hit by artillery. But. A T-29 has been called to the area, and this is where my problems begin. So he puts a shot into me. I don't realise that the T-29 has got very powerful frontal armour. And I take a shot there. Try and find some weak spots. But I'm just not getting through. So using the cover of the Tiger P, I move up. I bounce again. So I aim for his lower plate. And I finish him off. So now we're basically just pushing into the enemy base. Which is, if you look on the map, right in front of us. So now what we can do is we can cap, capture the base which will take a minute and we'll win the game but you've got to be cautious around this area because there can be artillery and like this Stuart Emil over there players can just be you know camping the base waiting for us to come through the Stuart Emil has got very thin armour but it's got one of the most powerful guns of its tier So I'm going to use the middle section as cover. And Stur is killed. So the play the enemy players in the middle, if you look on the map, would have been alerted to my position as the the base is being captured. I'm telling this KV1S to scout above the hill because there's uh, artillery still prowling but he doesn't listen so this bag this game's in the bag at the moment there's nothing really that could go wrong other than if that hum hummel done something but at the moment the Hummel has sort of hidden himself and I don't think he'll be coming so this KB1S is trying to push me out of the pace you you don't need to listen to people like this who tell you to get out of the cap circle there's no point you know we're gonna win and by the looks of the teams we could still lose and we don't really want to lose a game like this so yeah that was my first replay um, 
hopefully this will show you some basic battle tips and how to play the game. Um, I'll be dishing out some more replays soon. Um, I'll show you a review of hopefully as many tanks as I can show you and I'll start putting out some replays. Um, yeah, well thank you for watching, subscribe and good luck. <laughs> See ya.